What is up, guys, and welcome back to Stick War 2. It has certainly been a while since I made a video on Stick War 2, and um, wasn't trying to make it very long, but I did get hit with another case of demotivation for a little bit. But I finally broke out of it, and uh, it has left me with a ton of mods that I have to do videos on that I have not done yet, because again, I was demotivated again. But again, we are back. I'm saying it again a lot today. So, this is one that I'm going... This is the first modding video that I'm going to make or the mod that I made probably like two, two, three weeks ago, something like that. And it's nothing groundbreaking or anything like that, but uh, I guess it'll be a little update as to what I've been doing with modding if anybody even cares about that. And um, yeah, I did want to try and think of ways to make the modding content more interesting aside from me just recording the gameplay and commentating what's going on but that's really the best format that i currently have uh i'm not the most comedic person out there and uh, i don't exactly have the life of a celebrity so me telling you stuff that goes on outside of the channel would be as interesting as a history lesson so yeah let's not do that so the it'll fall it'll come down eventually for me uh ways to make the content more engaging but for now i'm just gonna stick with what i currently have so let's get into this so i do believe this one is called generals versus princes right yep here we go little backstory here you, Archies, Kaichu, Zephos, and Atreos have received word of the location of a trio who refer to themselves as the Rebel Princes of Inamorta. They are determined to destroy you and overthrow your regime. Okay, it's coming back to me now. In Stick or Legacy's assets, which I looked through to find these, don't kill me developers, uh, I found three crowns. Now these crowns were from Stick or Legacy, and they are the difficulty crowns that you get when you complete a mission on normal, hard, or insane. Normal is a small crown, medium, slightly larger crown, and insane is a big crown. There were three of those that I discovered. And I thought, you know what? What if I just took those crowns, threw them on some units, and called them princes? And that's exactly what we have here. It's, it's no groundbreaking thing. We're just going to be fighting three overpowered super units with four overpowered super units. Oh yeah, this is when I finally started learning to use cutscenes. We will finish you ourselves, they say. Now since then, I have made two more mods that use cutscenes more in depth, and I will make videos on those. But when I made this mod, I was beginning to learn to use the cutscenes because, you know, at first I flat out refused to learn the cutscene code, because it looked damn near impossible to do, but I eventually convinced myself to start learning about it, and it worked out pretty well. All right, so um, we have Archies, Kaiju, Zephos, and Atreos here against the three princes, and these guys hit pretty hard. Oh, and we have the refuse to dive, uh, the refuse to dive perk in here, where once the spirit and health gets low enough, they gain cyclone protection, and uh, we're getting curb stomped right now. We didn't kill the, the Prince, Spiritan, or the Sword, but we are going to take out both of them here, and that would just leave us with the Archonaut. And I actually forget that when the Generals die, they give me a gold boost because I was at 900 gold for a second there. So it's like a salvage of Smithy, but for Generals. Alright, so again, the Rebel Sword and the Rebel Spiritan are dead, they are going to respawn. All that's left is that Rebel Archer. And I'll take this moment to talk about the center towers. So, uh, a while back, I was studying how to add more center towers to the game. And after many months of failure, I was finally able to pull it off. And now there are five center towers. It actually six center towers. There's one in my base. There's one in the enemy base. And there's four in the center here. And they are attacking me already. Can you guys lay up? I'm trying to talk about stuff. God dang it, I didn't want that miner to do that. Holy crap, they already have three freaking spears. Yeah, I'm gonna have to mask Garrison. Jesus! 
Are you guys gonna let me talk? Clearly not. All right, we gotta garrison this guy. Get another spear. All right, so. Okay, z -Fos is back. Cool, we can use his DPS. But anyway, uh, let me buy Rage for him. And they are already re-attacking. They will not leave me alone. Goodness gracious, bro. All right, me to Forakai here, kill the spear. The Rebel Sword Prince is back. That's not good. So I'm going to fall back and wait for my next spear. I don't even know why I'm trying to build spears. They straight up get like three shot by these super units. It's ridiculous. Even with the Cyclone protection, they just don't stand a chance. I'm going to bring Zephos back out because uh, he does have a regeneration like all the other generals that I put in here. And okay, yeah, we have a downtime. So... When I initially made the five towers, I did make it to where they each spawned a ghost. But eventually, I got sick and tired of that because I always make the enemy stronger than me to obviously give them a better chance. And when they take these four center towers, that would be four ghosts. And then they used to get a ghost from this tower too, which made it five tower spawns. I got sick and tired of that. So I limited it to, uh, hold on here, that's shield wall. Zephos is back. We're going to use his rage now. Have him go in. There we go. So the way I fixed it was this tower and this tower. They, they're not going to spawn a ghost when you take control. But instead, you will get a lot of extra gold and mana from it. So think of the stick where three tower benefits, but actually insanely cracked. Then the these two center towers will spawn ghosts. And so will the tower in the player's base, which in fact, I'll go ahead and buy a tower spawn so you can see it. And they have the Rebel Prince Spiritin again. And we still didn't kill that archer, but I mean, I'm not too worried about him. Let's use Rage. Oh wait, I need fire arrows because I forgot when I added Archie to stick or two, I also gave him a pseudo tether ability it, it works similarly to tether but wait is that elbow targeting my archers yeah get one shot asshole but anyway uh let me save that gold spirit then. there we go anyway as i was saying uh when i added archies i gave him an ability that kind of works like tether but not exactly uh think of it as a tether range that is equal to that of fire arrows so again, I'll demonstrate it once fire arrows actually kicks in. In the meantime, let's attack this wall. Go ahead and break it down. So our attack into the enemy base will be easier. All right, they're pushing. Oh God, I thought I had a, wait, I did have a spear, but he, they got destroyed. God dang it. Okay, we gotta just fall back, bro. And they have a Magi kill. They have a tanky as hell Magi kill. All right, this ain't good. Anyway, as I was saying, uh, okay, here we go. This is where fire arrows come in for Archies. So here we go, watch this. I'm gonna use the ability, and let's click on the Rebel Prince Archer. You see that right there? That is the Treacher Root ability, which I have given to Archies when you use fire arrows. So it's gonna damage a target and stun them for a long period of time. And it actually, the damage is so insane that uh, I should be able to target that Magi kill with it. Wait, what? Did I not use, did I already burn the ability? Hold on, we gotta, let's just kill this guy with Rage. Raging z will kill this guy. Get the hell out of here, fool. And they have another one. Can you guys stop? Can you guys stop with the match I kill? There we go. Freaking Rage with z is so cracked. Man, I wish Stick War 3 z could be this strong. The following message has been identified and will hereby be stricken from the record. Man, I wish Stick War 3 z could be this strong. Wishing for a Stick War 3 general to be overpowered is against the law at the SO7 Corporation. Appropriate measures will be taken to ensure that such words are never said again. It's hilarious how he's just hit the bottom of the barrel lately. Alright, hold on. Let me, let's kill this guy. Get him with the Archie's root ability. But yeah, basically, uh, if I select a target with this, and 
uh, I use fire arrows. Archies will target that unit, and they will guarantee it's it's a hit confirm. Like, watch. I'm trying to collect that archer, friends. And we get him. We actually get him here. But we're not going to kill him because they're going to get units in front of the tank for him. Oh, and I forgot I added you to control, too, after a long time of struggling with it. All right, we need giant growth. We need passives. I'll buy minor wall, too. Why not? Let's get this. Let's get Shinobi. Let's just upgrade a whole bunch of crap that we're definitely going to be needing later. And we get here. We're actually doing a pretty decent job holding onto the towers, uh, despite their consistent pushing. They have been rather relentless. But we have been holding out for the most part. All right, I need Archies. Here we go. Let's go ahead and root one of these Magi kill and kind of just lock in the place. Oh God, he's dead. The Spiritian's dead. Wait, can we get the tower? Can we get the tower? Come on. Yes, we get one. We get one tower, but we need the other one. All right, we got to get these enemy units out of here. Get off, leave, leave the tower. There we go, there we go. Perfect. So now we have two of the center towers. We don't have all four of them, but at least we have three tower spawns now. All right, they don't seem to be having much of anything. What? Are you serious? How is that nearly dead Magi kill able to get a poison spray before he dies? Where's I have a Merrick? Bro, I don't have a Merrick. I think my Merrick died. I had a Merrick earlier, but I think it freaking died. You have got to be kidding me. Of course. I don't even know why I'm backing up. The archers are straight up dead. I hate that so much. A nearly dead match I kill, pulling up a poison spray, makes me so mad. I lost like half my archer stack to that asshole. And now we're at risk of losing the tower because here's all three of the Prince units. And... They're going to absolutely just eviscerate my freaking spirits in here. They're probably going to eviscerate the enslaved giant too. But I have three of the four center towers now, and I have no interest in backing up and giving the towers up to them. And now they have another freaking magi kill and three spears. Oh yeah, my giant's actually just going to eat it. Yep, yep. So much for having three of the towers. We're going to end up losing them here. And now my Merrick shows up. All right, hold up. This is starting to annoy the hell out of me here. And my merit just got one shot by the stupid Archer Prince. Fantastic. And that merit's gonna die too. All right, you know what? If this is what's gonna happen, then I'm just gonna triple cast lock to these fools. They're already making me so mad beyond belief. All because of that one pathetic Magi kill. Hero Magi kill. Hitting a poison spray before he freaking died. I cannot stand that. Alright, we're fine as long as the prin Oh god, the Prince Sword's targeting us. We need to get rid of him quickly. Of course, there's a Magi kill. This AI just loves humping Magi kill, clearly. We get z so we're gonna use his Rage. We get a Ninja, we're gonna send him right at... Two... Magi kill. Ah! Freaking stupid! And now we're gonna get poisoned! Garrison. What? Garrison the archers? Holy crap! Why is nothing working? Alright, come back out. I'm gonna go for a blast. Don't you poison spray. Don't I swear if you poison spray, I'm gonna be livid. Bro, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, there is nothing in front of this match I killed. Thank you. Oh my god, they're at they are so annoying. They are so annoying. It is stupid. Move, bitch. Another match I killed. Jesus Christ. If I got a dollar with every match I kill this stupid AI made, I'd be stupid rich right now. And then of course. Right when I root the match I kill to snipe him, oh, lo and behold, the enemy decides to re-attack and support the wizard. And he still gets a poison spray off before he dies. How is this AI this freaking lucky? I cannot stand these fools. Die. Freaking 
die. They have another one, don't they? Yep. They have another. I swear to God, I'm, I'm about to. Di I'm about to disable the magic kill for them. I'm about to dis. When the hell did I make a sword rat? You gotta be kidding me here. All right, use Archie's root ability. We're gonna root that Prince Sword Wrath and kill him because I just don't want him alive. Like, forget the Albatross. There you go, he's dead. Atreus, you're alive. I'm gonna keep you alive. There we go, we get rid of him and we'll get a free Spirit and kill too. All right, I told you to garrison, dude. Do what I tell you to do. All right. Oh wait, they have nothing. They actually have nothing. They actually have nothing. I don't care about that wizard either. We're going in here. And we are going to root the Prince Archer. There you go, we got him. We gotta watch out for that poison spray. There we go. Now kill this asshole. Die! Now we're gonna get the Prince Archer while we're at it. Get out of here. Oh, they're gonna turn around and re-attack, but there you go. Now they have no super units. We can capitalize. Uh, and we gotta reclaim the towers. Uh, and one of the things that's getting on my nerves is these random ass albatross suddenly deciding to target my backline units. Like, you guys are annoying. Alright, please control 3B archers so we don't get poison sprayed. Alright, here we go. We need to just kill these guys. You know, I told that Golden Spirit to like three times to Garrison, but you know, if he doesn't want to listen, then he's going to make themselves useful and kill the with. Oh my god, they have their own giant. What is happening? I mean to pull this back. I don't understand how these Spiritans are surviving for so long. Come on, bro. Just die. Alright, I have my own Magi kill. The comeback starts now. We just need a poison spray to kick things off. Are you kidding? Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me, they backed up. They backed up just long- <laughs> They backed up just long enough. Just long enough- WHAT?! Well, I'm gonna lose all my arches now, because all of a sudden, this Magi kill is like, 5 million IQ! I can't, what is going on today? This isn't even about the Prince units, it's about the stupid Magi kill that I keep getting destroyed by. Bro, I had a whole ass Spearton in front of that Magi kill, and then he just pulls off a backline snipe out of nowhere. Oh my god, yeah, here's Giant Girl 2, what the hell does it matter? What does it matter? It, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. It actually just doesn't matter. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Everything's gonna fall apart. Everything's falling apart. Everything is falling apart. Holy crap. Oh no, I didn't want to use the control. Holy, please fall back. God. Jeez, although if Kaichu and Archie die, I know they respawn, so I don't have anything to worry about here. All right, I need a Magi kill. I need ninjas i need 10 billion dollars i need so much crap right now all i can do is hope that these poison archers die and if a merrick shows up i'm just gonna straight up root it with archies or you know what better yet root this asshole no they have a merrick they have a merrick root root the merrick root the merrick root the merrick, root the merrick. you know what i'm gonna be stupid here yeah there we go archies died and now kaitu died too let's try and build a wall i guess i broke the wall limit i found out how to do that so I can build a wall at any place in the map that I want. But um, we're gonna have to go cast Lutcher 3 here because we are, we're not doing good. And I'm gonna put a wall right here so uh, we can't get rushed by the Prince units or any stupid bull crap like that. And everything is dead. Everything is dead because apparently they have Magi Kill that have graduated from the most prestige university on this planet and it, it of course. You guys are you guys are some stupid, lucky, rigged assholes. Oh that miner's dead. I didn't even I didn't even tell you to come out. I didn't even tell you to come out. 
Miner had a mind of his own. Nobody wants to listen to me. That's why you're dead. It's entirely your fault. It's entirely your fault. I hope these cast lunches straight up eat you guys for breakfast. Please. Mega, why are you targeting? Bro, this sword is worthless, Castle Archer. Please target the wizards. I'm not coming out until those Magi Kill are dead. I don't care. Except they're not targeting the Magi Kill. Now we have to come out and now we have to come out and kill them. All right, I have two ninjas. Of course, we get poison spray right when I bring my archers out because I just can't get lucky today. Oh, I had two Magi Kill. Hold up. The comeback starts now, baby. We're going for a double electric wall. Please stay right there and eat this damage. Yes, 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 yes. That was beautiful. Oh, oh, you think that you think you're gonna live, Magic? You think you're gonna live? No, 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 no. You're not gonna live. I don't care if you blast me. I don't care if you blast me, dude. Get out of here. Die. Oh God, don't, don't run into that. Don't run into that. Don't run into that. Don't run into that. Hold position. There you go. Okay, that was stupid, bro. How long does the electric wall last? I didn't edit that. I didn't make it longer. Felt like it was longer, though. Alright, Garrison you. We have a chance. Uh, except they have another match I killed. But I'm still gonna rush because we really have to take advantage of this. Guess what? Priority is now match I kill and nothing else. I don't care about the Prince units. We target a match I kill every time we see it. That is simply how this works. I'm gonna go for a shield bash here. Never mind. And uh, I. Wait, what? <gasps> oh my god, I forgot about that. Bro, I forgot about that. I could have made this easier for myself without even realizing it, bro. I forgot I made it to when Kaiju and Archie's respawn, a golden archer also spawns with them. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. You know what? Well, now I have a strategy. If I just let Arceus and Kaichu die every once in a while, I'm going to slowly build up an army of golden archers. And then those mads I kill are going to be able to do crap with that. Uh, we're going to commit to this push. I'm really just trying to get mileage right now. Although now we're overextending. We got to fall back. But now I have... Now my DPS with the archers is a lot stronger. So you know what? Let's implement this strategy. I'm gonna let Kaichu get killed here. And that's gonna give me another Golden Archer when he comes back. I'm gonna keep Archie's alive because I wanna take advantage of his root ability so I can just root stuff. I probably shouldn't keep the match I killed there. But we're gonna have him pull. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's just fall back from this completely. That's a terrifying army right there. There we go. Uh, it's just the Spirit and Prince left. Once we get rid of him, we're good. And these Albatross have a Death Wish. These Albatross have a Death Wish. Oh, they're, they're still trying to push with the Magi kill. Um, I'm going to use the Golden Archers to phase tank for a little bit. They have two Magi kill. All right, we gotta pull that one away. I don't want the golden arches dying. Oh, oh, oh god. My Magi Killer exposed. Holy crap, we gotta build a wall. Get a wall, get a wall, get a wall, get a wall. Okay, thank god we have a giant. Let's go. Get another one. I'm just gonna bring the giant all the way out here and just learn and just bait all these spells. Bait all of these damn spells. Let's park the giant right here, actually. Right into the double electric wall. Wow, that giant really did not last for long. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna lose a match I kill here. God, 
god dang it, they are being ridiculously relentless. And the thing is, their army isn't even that damn big. Can you guys fuck off? Alright, we're gonna root one of these match I kill. Please, yes, freaking die. Target the wizard, I don't care about anything else. Thank you. And I'm gonna use I'm gonna use a golden archer to face tank here if they decide to turn around. Alright, we're gonna root the Prince Archer, and that's actually perfect because now they're retreating, so we're gonna kill this guy uh, pretty much for free. But we're not out of the woods yet because now I have to restore my tower progress. Which is gonna take a long time. This enemy is so, this AI is so annoying. So unbelievably annoying. And we have like way too much mana. There's like 5 billion mana. Get off of mana. And we're gonna delete this wall, and now we're gonna build another one out farther. So, we're gonna bring this guy out. It'll be just like Stick War 3, where you damn near have no freaking wall limit there. Alright, Kaichu isn't back yet, but I think I'm gonna send Archies to die now, because again, I want to have more gold than Archers, and to do that, I have to get Kaichu and Archies to keep dying to trigger the respawn timer. So uh, let's just do that. Go ahead and get Archie to just root somebody and let them pick them off. And I know I know it seems cruel, but trust me, it's for the best. All right, we need a wall here. There you go, Archie's is down. And now guess what? Kaichu's back and I have another golden archer. There you go, that's the strat. That is the strat. Slowly stack up golden archers by sacrificing archies and kaiju. Although, I don't like that this, this is a massive army. Holy crap, this is really bad. They have three magi kill. Oh my god, do you guys know where the chill pill is? You clearly don't. You clearly freaking don't. Damn, bro, get the magic kill spam a freaking rest. Oh, they have a giant too, how fantastic. Well, guess what, Zephos Rage, uh, two hits magic kill, so we'll flawlessly deal with that at least. There you go, all the magic kill are dead. I'm gonna try and rebuild this wall. And they have two Merricks to deal with my poison sprays. Another freaking Magi kill. And we have not killed these freaking spears yet. What is taking so long? I have freaking... Th Damn, I have three Golden Archers and Kaichu. We should be melting these fools. Pull back, pull back. Everybody hold, everybody freaking hold. Oh my god, they are absolutely being relentless right now. And they have two prints. They have, bro, they have all three prince units again. Yeah, my giant's gonna die. And so is the wall. And probably my Merricks and Mads I kill too. And guess what? I still haven't gotten the towers. Oh, my Mads I killed clutched a poison spray before he died. Hold on, give me Kaichu to face tank. Oh wait, I can't do that. The stupid Prince Spiritin is not dead yet. Holy crap. Leave me alone. All right, here we go. They're vulnerable here. They're vulnerable. We're going for it. Oh, I don't care. I'm running past this giant. I am running past this giant, and I'm picking up their backline stuff. Oh, here we go. They're going to turn around, thinking they have the advantage. Well, guess what? You don't. Oh, you guys are going to get shit on. You guys are going to get annihilated right now. Oh, 
<sighs> Three more spears, another stupid match I kill. Like, it has literally been extremely difficult trying to punch through their stupid attacks enough for me to get damage on their economy and their base. And that's exactly why I'm trying to stack up a Golden Archer Cal. So I'm gonna say I'm gonna send Kaichu to die here. But we're gonna have to do it. I am seriously trying to, to get a strong enough army to punch through them here. And the best way is to just build up enough Golden Archers to have some broken DPS. Wow, they already have five spears. Five spiritons again already. Jesus Christ. I would engage them, but uh, we're not exactly in that position. Oh, hold on, never mind. Oh, wait. I lost the spiritin. I for that damn statue archer that I. I just had to give them a statue archer too. And that's proven to be very helpful for me. God dang it, bro. Yeah, my only way is my only way out of this is Golden Archer spam, clearly. Look at this! Look how many spears they have! What the hell? Alright, the good news is Zephos is gonna melt them. Or at least come close to melting them. At least we get some free Magi kill here. I am absolutely committing to this. There we go. Now we pull them back. Oh my god, we are still in range of that statue, Archer. Jesus Christ. Alright, get a wall right here. There we go. We have a lot more golden archers now. Yeah, this is the key. Oh my god. I keep getting in range of the damn statue, Archer. And he still killed my Oh man, why am I bothering to even build spears? We need the towers. Please cap the towers and get tower spawn too. Alright, uh, I'm gonna keep on stacking it up, so, uh, Kaichu, you know what, let's just send both of them to die just now, just go ahead and do it, send both of them to die, to so just go ahead and restart the respawn timers to get more golden archers. All right, this is the final army that honestly should be enough to freaking overwhelm them here. Look, like if this doesn't work, then Jesus Christ, this crap's too overpowered. But I have so much crap pushing in right now. Big army of golden archers, big army of everything. No reason why we don't take it here. Kill that stupid prince archer, and let's freaking end this crap. Reading splash damage though, we gotta bring a... Uh... Oh yeah, and please ignore the statue, Archer. He is not important. There you go, we're finally gonna win. I don't think I gave them the ability to get a health boost here. If they did, I'm actually gonna just... I'm just gonna be so mad at myself if I did that. 
but I'm pretty sure they don't get a health boost. We just take the statue down. There we go. There you go. Freaking get out of here. That took way too long. Way longer than it should have, but there you go. We finally defeated the stupid princes with their overpowered bullcrap magic kill. So yep, yeah, that'll be all for this video, and I will see you in the next one.